Hi guys, you welcome back again to my page MJ Fun TV. Nigerian youth and mobile fans are currently in his grave protecting it and guiding it. Because of this interview that Nigerian police released saying that they want to go and dig up his grave for investigation and all of that. But Nigerians don't trust the police and they claim that Naira Mali had godfather, political godfather, so they might be working hand in hand or planning one or two things because why would they want to dig it at night because they planned to do that yesterday night but they have been here since waiting for them to come this is so serious because nigerian police in their interview was saying that they need to you know dig it up and do autopsy and all of that and um it's that night they want to do it so nigerians were finding that suspicious why at night why not in the daytime why not normal for my opinion i think if nigerian police even want to do anything fishy or suspicious or you know they want to do something really awkward because they can do it even if they do it at night or daytime that's just the truth so even guiding the grave is not really going to help the reasons nigerians are having distrust issues with the police and all of this you know is because of naira mali's um naira mali's boy sam larry and the rest of them that are busy making mouth that they have political godfather that nobody can touch them nothing can happen to them that you know they have leg to the very top more than we think you know all of that insinuation so nigerians are so angry all this started after this video was posted on instagram this particular video with mobile's dad and um they've agreed that i think the body should be exhumed this midnight of first thing tomorrow morning and um i just thought i should let you know and um they are still taking the questioning of the father and i'm trying to speak to the cp the cp is trying to speak to them so that they can allow us going with our phone Okay, um, I'm at this place right now, and the reason why I'm outside is because they don't allow us going with the phone. So um, the mother is take, they're taking the statement for the mother and uh, Mobat's wife right now. A few witnesses that we have here, they're taking their statement. Um, um, we're trying to get through the CP so that they can hasten them up and uh, so that the body can be exhumed on time for um, the proper autopsy, you know. They need more people to bring proof now. They need people who are dropping videos to come out and talk. Now, there's, a, there's, there's like a strong room where they take you to go and talk. They are not arresting anybody. They are not detaining anybody or keeping anybody. It's just for you to come and talk. Tell us what you see and what you hear. So I don't know how we want to go about this, this idea to, to, to make this happen. We have a uh, cassette in the So well, I, don't, I don't for now want to limit and start mentioning specific uh, individuals. Everybody linked to it will be identified and they will be brought most Nigerians are complaining about Mobat's father. According to them, Mobat's father looks so suspicious. And why did he rush and bury uh, Mobad on the next day after he died? Given the fact that Mobad is not a Muslim but a Christian, why did he rush and bury him that his, even his own biological mother was not present? Most of this complaint is coming after this Mobad father was seen in a video complaining about the house where he lives and the car his son got for him and how poor it is and how he's living, his condition, why the wife is with all the property and all the money. Meanwhile, his son just died and he was not looking like someone that was money. He was talking about property, money, and why did the son leave all the property under his son's name? You know, Mobad's five-month-old son is the one to inherit everything he had. And the man saw that as a problem. We don't understand if he wants to be the one to inherit it. We don't really know. Meanwhile, the worst thing that happened was when a voice note of him leaked where he was saying that um, Naira Mali did not kill or hurt his son, that Naira Mali was only trying to teach his son a lesson so that he'd be strong as a strong boy. You know that kind of statement from a father that your own son complained of someone haunting him when he was still alive. And the only thing you can say is that now that he's gone. So Nigerians are so disappointed in this father and wishing never to have such a father. And at the same time, they are complaining that the Nigerian police should look into him as the major suspect after Naira Mali. I don't know what your opinion is about this, but comment down below whatever you think about this news. Meanwhile, Nara Mali and Zinolensky and Samlari are busy flying from one country to another, enjoying their life. They are not yet in Nigeria, they are running for their life and, you know, no one knows their current whereabouts. This is so heartbreaking that they are thinking they are going to go scot-free. While we keep praying for Mobat so to continue resting in perfect peace, we will see you guys on our next one. Hey, my people! So Wolu is trying to derail Mobad case by inviting DSS. Let me ask you people something. Why is it that So Wolu all of a sudden 
is now inviting DSS to a case that is within the jurisdiction of the Nigerian police to investigate. If they are not trying to hide something, if they are not trying to cover up something, why invite DSS? Let me tell you, my people. Eh, Naramale, Nastawolu friend, I challenge someone to come out now and tell us, say, you know, no, Naramale, picture come out now. He begin to invite DSS. Is it not the same Sawolu that has not uh, accepted what really happened in Lekki Toll Gate? No justice. And he's now telling you that he will give justice to Mubad. Sawolu is trying to derail this case. I believe Mubad's body is being exhumed. Mubad's body is being brought out of the grave today for the autopsy his body is coming back out to the top of the earth so i want us to pray right now father in the name of jesus as mobad's body as a lady's body as promises body as a mother's body comes back out of the earth as it comes out of the earth today, Lord, as it is brought out of the earth, as it is dug out of the earth, Father, let every truth that has been hidden concerning this man's death, even concerning his life, his sufferings, let every secret that has been buried concerning this boy's death, let everyone that has been hiding, that have buried themselves somewhere, that have hidden themselves somewhere, or that have been hidden or protected by anybody, let them all come to the surface today. In the name of Jesus, from today, let them begin to come to the surface. Let them begin to be exposed. Let us begin to see everything that has been hidden about this boy's life and death, every secret that has been hidden. Father, let it come as Mubad's body comes out of the earth today. Let every secret about his death also come out from wherever they have hidden it either using physical means legal means spiritual means whatever means they have used to hide secrets that can expose the killers of this boy father as his body comes out of the earth today for autopsy let those secrets begin to come out in the name of jesus christ let his killers begin to be exposed in the name of jesus christ and father let everyone that wants to do anything Hey, anyone that wants to do anything to, to sabotage this investigation, anyone that is already planning to go behind and bribe anybody or that is already bribing anybody or anybody that is trying to manipulate or that is planning to manipulate anybody that is fighting for anything but the truth concerning Mubad's death. Father, after that body has been brought out, they have to put it back inside the earth after the autopsy. And as they are putting that body back inside the earth, let the bodies of such people follow him back into that earth in the mighty name of Jesus. Anyone that does not want the truth of his death to come out whenever they return that his body into the earth because they must return it let such people let their bodies to follow him down into the earth in the mighty name of jesus christ amen justice for mubad thank you so much for watching this video for daily entertainment news and celebrity good and bad updates and all you need to know that's happening in the country don't forget to hit this red subscribe button turn on the notification bell to always stay connected to us one love and God bless you all. Don't forget to thumbs up to this video and comment down below what you think about this.